you or online at hiphousechat.com. We have traveled back over to Dade County this morning, and let me tell you something, they know how to treat you right and feed you right when you come over here to Dade County this morning. We are on top of Lookout Mountain at Cafe 136 in this beautiful corner spot at the back of the restaurant, talking with Cheyenne Boatner and Christy Pardue, who has made us this delicious plate of food. So thanks for letting us come in. You're welcome. Y'all are open breakfast, lunch, and dinner, so do you ever sleep, Christy? Well. You know, sometimes I try to get in bed. I try to get in bed about eight because I'm back up around three. You are indeed. And I love that what you do here is you kind of make people feel like in a way they've stepped back in time because this is Southern cooking at its best, right? Yes, ma'am. Learned in large part from your mom. My grandmother. Your grandmother. And my mom. Yes. Both of them was cooks in restaurants. So you kind of feel your way through. These are labors of love for you when you're in that kitchen. It is, yes. So here's what I can't believe. We walked in this morning and uh, Greg, who owns the restaurant, is not here. Right. So we get Greg on the phone and he says, oh, sorry, I can't be there, but that's okay. Cheyenne and Christy will step in and they'll take over. How old are you, Cheyenne? I'm 17. She's 17 years old. Uh, and yet you are uh, an integral part of the success mm. here at this business. Do you love it? I love it. Do you meet people from all over? Everywhere. There was a couple coming here from Austria. I was like, that's crazy. Yeah, that is crazy. Mm -hmm. And are they coming for your meatloaf? You chose to make us meatloaf this morning, Christy. This is one of your best sellers. Yeah, that's our staple. I, I, I mean, we sell so much meatloaf uh, through the week. We are literally prepping just about every day prepping meatloaf. So I'd say about 120 pounds of meatloaf a week. Roughly. That's a lot of meatloaf. It is. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. you can't possibly tell me your trade secret, but is the secret to a good meatloaf the sauce on top or is it making the, the meat inside moist but still feel like it's just meat, like not seeing too much of the bread in there? Right. It, the secret, you don't want it to fall apart. You want it to hold together. Yeah. So it's, you know, the, the secret to holding it together is bread and, and I'm not going to tell you everything. Right, you but, can't. But the topping is is something we just kind of played with and made up and ourselves. Well, I'm going to dig in in a minute, and it's a big enough plate I think you can share. So y'all got some silverware, too. You have to join me in it, okay? Okay. But this room that we're in today at the restaurant, this is in the back. Um, the view is spectacular. Do y'all use this primarily for special events, or can anybody? We, yes, we have uh, parties, like we've had baby show showers out here and um, birthday parties. Um, we have a lot of caterings that we'll do and we'll shut this area off. Now we used to have karaoke on Friday, but we haven't had it in a while. But it, it was a big thing there for a while. You also, you mentioned the tourists that come in, so this family from Austria. A lot of people, you're just a stone's throw from Cloudland Canyon. Yes. So you have a to-go window. Yes. You can get an order and then go soak in the view and have a picnic if you yes, want. Yes, ma'am. Now you, I'm sure you like the meatloaf, Cheyenne, but you have a sweet tooth item that's your favorite on the menu. The hot fudge cake. It's so good. Is it? Mm -hmm. And the peach cobbler you like. Oh, yes, it. that's so good. Do you keep the menu the same every night, Christy, or do you change it up? Oh, no, I change it up. Um, like, meatloaf is a staple, so it's an everyday thing. Mm -hmm. But I'll do a special, you know, whether it be chicken casserole on Thursdays. Uh, on Friday, we'll do a... a fish, but I'll do cabbage for the vegetarians. I'll do steamed cabbage and uh, black eyed peas and, you know, so they have something to choose from when yeah. they come here. You seem like a real tight-knit group that works here, so I would think it would be hard to be a first-time customer at the restaurant and not feel like you're welcomed right in. Oh, yeah. We have all, our regulars, a lot of them come every day. They will. Every day? Yeah. Cheaper than eating at home, probably. A lot of times, yeah, and it's easier if you're working. So it's been a long time since I've had a meatloaf. Can I dig in? Yeah, sure. Do you I want to share it with me? I'm going to slide the plate a little bit closer yeah. to me. Okay. If you, I mean, you're welcome to. I just hate to be rude and eat in no. front of you, no, Cheyenne. You go right ahead. Before you head off down there to college. So you can't tell me the secret sauce that's on here, can you? I can't. No. Is it going to be tangy? Mm, you'll just I have, have to try eat it. And, yeah, try and see. Mm-hmm. 
Mm -hmm. You like it? No, it tastes like being eight years old in my mama's kitchen. Oh, wow, thank you. Mm -hmm. You know, nobody ever makes a dish like your mom. You want that to be replicated if it's going to be an old southern home cooking. Yeah. That's what you've done. Yeah. Well, and it's, but it's a nice, thick piece of meatloaf. Yeah. That's very good. Yeah. Well, thank you so much. So y'all are open seven days a week? Yes, ma'am. Um, do you have special things for breakfast? Um, just big items? everything, really. Just come here? People love the omelets. They come here and they get the omelets a lot. Okay. If you are in the Chattanooga area and you wanted to have something catered, do y'all know how far away you cater? Oh, we can. We you can? can? Yeah. Okay. It's not a problem. So, are you? before I let you run, um, the Alliance for Dade is what's been bringing us up here. We've been coming your way now for the last couple of months, going to different spots. And we're always amazed at all that's here yeah. uh, in the one zip code mm -hmm. of Dade County. Are you watching it grow? Oh, yeah. Since I was younger, uh, it growing up and seeing it, it's gotten so much bigger, so much. A lot of more people have moved from Florida because I don't know why. I don't get it because I'd rather be in Florida. Well, look at the view. <laughs> That's why. It's beautiful here. Yeah, it is. It's beautiful. Well, you come and find for yourself. You'll see uh, that Christie's meatloaf is just as good as the 120 pounds of it served a week <laughs> will prove at Cafe 136. You'll meet Cheyenne and Christy and the whole team that's here, and you'll feel like you are part of their family, whether you're in the front of the restaurant or the back. So thanks for welcoming us in. Oh, you're Thank welcome. You. Good luck and call. Thank you. I love to work. I've done it my whole life. I've been hurt, and now I can't work. What do I do? Every week the feds took money out of my paycheck in case I couldn't work. I've been denied my social security disability. The feds refused to pay me my money, so I hired WG. WG does SSD. 